But let me say, I'm a huge Wendy Williams fan. I love Wendy Williams. I was on her show numerous times. Wendy treated me great. Um, our shows basically started at the same time. I was a big fan of her show, so I'm I'm all in Wendy Williams' corner. But when I watched last night on that show, it disturbs me because I doesn't think it does any good for Wendy. It doesn't make her look good. She obviously has big time struggles, medical conditions, and addiction. And what they're showing is somebody is not protecting her. Um, it doesn't put her in a good light. I don't see how this serves any purpose at all. Um, she should, one, uh, her manager talking about, is she ready to do a podcast? She's ready. She's been doing this for 20 years. She's in no position to do anything, interviewing. She should not be interviewing anybody. So before you start talking about putting her back out in the public, you should be getting her help, making sure she recovers fully and that she's able to do it. Because I got to tell you, I was disturbed and I'm saddened by, I feel people uh, using her. Um, they're not, they're not protecting her. And I hope that somebody close to Wendy says, Hey, we shouldn't be doing this. We got to get her help and put an end to this nonsense. So we're all praying for you, Wendy. Hey, my Nefertiti's and Kings out there. You already know who it is. And we are back with another great episode of a Nefertiti girls living in an ethnic modern world. So today in the news clip, we have Steve Wilkos and Tammy Roman. Now, Steve Wilkos and Tammy Roman, they are coming out and addressing their concerns that they have with Wendy Williams after viewing her two part docuseries with a Lifetime Movie Network. Where is Wendy Williams? OK, now um, Steve Wilkos came out and addressed a couple things and he said that he believed that uh no one in her camp is taking care of her he believed that they're all using her um he did point out uh her uh manager Will Shelby, is, uh, he should need to be ashamed of himself. Uh, he's trying to get her to work and uh, do podcasting when she shouldn't be interviewing anyone. Now, these are coming out of his mouth. Um, she shouldn't be interviewing anyone, um, and she should be trying to concentrate on her health and battling her addictions, okay? Now, you know that Wendy Williams obviously suffered from alcoholism and alcohol addiction, but she also still probably suffer and this is allegedly from the white powder donuts now uh it was put out there that she was still doing it but who knows if she is or if she isn't um at this point it is nice for steve wilkos to come out and address his concern as a fellow uh you know um talk show host himself you know um just for someone to um from inside of her world uh to come and address and speak up for her and um say that he's wishing nothing but the best and prayers for her is is absolutely wonderful also uh her guest that she had on was tammy roman um she said that williams uh wendy williams always used her platform platform um to put me in a, a better position to win this uh saddens me and that wendy you are, are always loved and respected by me and i haven't uh stopped praying for you of uh, the queen of media okay now um i pray and phrase that really quick but uh like i said you will see all that um where you can read it uh yourself uh but you know i i just feel so bad for wendy williams um but make sure you like comment and subscribe um make sure you guys comment down below and let me know what your views and thoughts on steve wilkos uh do you believe what he was saying is true about the manager and do you believe that he uh that she has a whole bunch of vultures around her um make sure you like comment and subscribe and if nobody told you that they love you just remember god loves you each and every day and each and every way Audi.